Hello everybody, a long time no see. Welcome back to the channel for another video today. We are home from vacation and that means that we need to go to the grocery store. Also that means we have a lot of Timu packages that are going to be uh, shown in a haul later this week. So stay tuned for that because there were four of them when I got home. But we have like literally no food in the pantry very little going on in there and it's the same thing in the refrigerator there's quite literally nothing in the refrigerator so this is what we're doing we're going to food lion today i'm about to go by myself i'm gonna shop i will show you that haul and then i am also placing a food or i'm sorry a sam's club order um, i'll probably place that tonight to pick up tomorrow on sunday you guys should see this video on Sunday and the Sam's Cup haul on Monday. So those are the two that I for sure have coming in. And like I said, that Timu haul, because again, four packages. So that is what we got going on, but we have a excellent vacation. We did a lot of fun stuff. Um, it was definitely relaxing to just like turn my phone off, unplug, not do anything with like YouTube or anything for the week on either one of my channels. It was nice to just take a little bit of a break and relax with my family, but I'm back at it. Um, we've been home for a couple hours now. We got most of the stuff unpacked and now I'm gonna go to the grocery store. So I'm gonna go see how much damage I'm gonna do there and then I will show it to you when I get back. I'm back from the grocery store. My hair's put up in a ponytail, as you can tell, because it is 9 million degrees right now here in North Carolina. It is like, we have temperatures over the next several days that are gonna be like 100 or more. Um, it's hotter here than it was in Myrtle Beach area where we were. So I put the hair up because I was sweating trying to load everything into the car, but I have everything laid out here behind me. I did spend a pretty good amount, which I knew I was going to. We have no food. So I spent $187 at Food Line today. I'm still not sure what my Sam's Cup pickup order is going to be. I'm still adding stuff to that. But I did um, think of the meals for the week as I was going through the store. I did kind of winged it. Um, and I'll tell you what they are when we get to their ingredients. But there are certain um, things that I'm getting at Sam's Club that go with meals, if that makes sense. Like, for instance, we're having meatball subs and the subs and the spaghetti sauce are both coming from Sam's Club. So I just got the meatballs. But I'll kind of tell you what I'm missing and all of that. So... Without further ado, let me go ahead, turn you around and share with you what I picked up today. First thing, I got some taco seasoning mix, the reduced sodium one. We're having tacos this, this week. That's one of the meals. I got four of the Food Lion Crispy Thin Crust Cheese Pizzas. These were on sale for 99 cents and the kids eat these a lot during the week. I did get some turkey. This is the Taste of Inspiration's lower sodium turkey. There's Piper as always. Oh, okay. Um, we're actually going to eat this for dinner tonight. We're going to have sandwiches. Oops. We're going to have sandwiches and chips and stuff for dinner tonight. So I got a pound and a half or just under a pound and a half. I'm sure we'll have some left for throughout the week, but the main thing was for it to be in meal tonight. Frosted cookies and cream donuts or pop tarts for Kylie. And then Bryson likes the fro frosted chocolate chip. I cannot talk. You can tell it's been a while since I've done one of these because I don't even know how to speak. Um, two bags of steam fresh sweet peas. These were on sale four for $5. The drinks, Pepsi products were buy one, get one free. And Food Lion still takes the half off even if you don't buy two. So I only got three. I got one six pack of the Baja Blast Mountain Dew for Bryson, and then two of the Zero Sugar Dr. Peppers for Chris. We're having hamburgers um, one night this week. That's another one of the meals. And so I got these farmhouse brioche buns. These were on sale. They actually were the cheapest ones. The Mer Merida or Merida? Merida? Merida bread is for Chris for breakfast. Um, like he eats like bacon sandwiches pretty much every morning. Um, this was actually like, this isn't what I would have gone for because it is pricier, but the food line man, the food line bread man had not made his way there yet. So he probably will be in there tomorrow on Sunday, but they didn't have any at all. So I went with that. I think that was like two 99 for that loaf of bread. Um, the honey vanilla Greek yogurt that we love. I just got one of these this week since I did have some other lunch options as well. I knew that we wouldn't eat two of them. 
sour cream for tacos. I got a little one because I always end up throwing some away. We don't go through it before it's bad. And I literally always throw some away. So I got a little one of those. And then I did get the Jack's special salsa for taco night. So we're having tacos. And then we're also having some chicken taquitos with Mexican rice. So this will be for both of those things. I mentioned these Clausen pickles um, a couple grocery hauls ago, and they are so, so good. They are a little pricey for pickles. They're like $5.99 for this thing of pickles, but they're the best pickle you'll ever taste. Even Chris agrees. He eats these like crazy. So I got another thing of those since we're having sandwiches for dinner. These are the sandwich rolls that we're going to use tonight for dinner. These are the um, plain ciabatta rolls, but they're soft ciabatta rolls. Like sometimes you'll get really hard ones. Um, and these ones are soft. I think you get eight in here. I'm going to be getting some more rolls and sub rolls and stuff at Sam's Club, but this was just to get us through dinner tonight. Meatballs for the meatball subs. And then I did get some of my favorite French fries, the McCain five minute fries for hamburger night. Um, let's see, we'll, we'll just finish up here first. The vanilla caramel coffee creamer for me, and then unsalted saltine crackers for Chris. This is all of the stuff for Mexican nights. Um, we have these um, chicken taquitos. We're gonna do those one night with this Mexican rice. And I'll probably, I have two green peppers in there that I need to cook before they go bad. So I'll probably do some like green peppers and onions. We have a few things going on this week in the evening. Um, the girls have vacation Bible school. Bryson is actually too old for it. It's through, no, he's got one more year, but he didn't wanna go because his friend was too old. But anyway, um, those, so the girls are going Sunday through Thursday to vacation Bible school. Chris has a meeting on Wednesday. We'll be at the pool, whatever. So I am doing, you know, easier meals. Just wanted to throw that in there. So tacos, the taquitos, sandwiches, meatball subs, easy peasy stuff uh, for the summer months for us. But we do have that going on. I think they may actually feed them at vacation Bible school, but we're not sure. But it's like 6 to 8.30 every single night. Um, so I'll feed them night one and then we'll see, we'll go from there. But I wanted to add that little touch in. So yeah, the taquitos and the Mexican rice will be one meal. And then these are the, the options I bought for the actual tacos, these nacho cheese stand and stuff shells, and then these soft tortilla flour bowls um, for tacos. I got two things of LaCroix back there, one of the Raz Cranberry and one of the Pomplamoose absolute favorite. And then Finley still wears pull-ups to bed just because I'm lazy. Uh, and I don't want to change a sheet in the middle of the night, even though she never wets it, but I'm scared. So we still put her in pull-ups and we needed some more. So I got a thing of those. Uh, produce. I am getting more produce at Sam's, but this is what I got to get us started until I go. Um, four ears of corn for hamburger night. Kylie usually likes cantaloupe and honeydew is in the same similar family and this was on sale. So I thought I would give this a go and see if she likes it. I got two and a half pounds for only $5. So I thought that was a pretty good deal. Um, so we'll see if she likes this. Um, you know, good to try new things. I also got a bunch of bananas, two things of strawberries, and then one thing of green grapes because these grapes looked really good and crispy. Although we all know I'll probably buy more of them at Sam's Club. Um, and then there is a head of lettuce for tacos as well. Um, ground beef. So this is the 73%. I normally wouldn't buy this high fat content, but it was on sale and it made it $3.38. So you know what? We'll eat it with our tacos. Um, and I'll get some more at Sam's Club. I probably could have just waited and gotten it all at Sam's, but I bought it, you know? So this is for me. I've mentioned before that I'm allergic to peanuts. Um, this wow butter is the closest thing I've ever tasted that tastes like peanuts um, uh, or peanut butter. I was not allergic until I was 20. So I know what peanut butter tastes like. Um, and this is for me the closest one that I have found. So this is a plant protein. This is pricey. It is $6. Um, or like $6.99 even for this. But my thought with this is to take sandwiches to the pool and quicker lunches and stuff like that other than turkey, like stuff that I have to keep colder. Um, I thought this would be good. And I might even get like Finley. She might even try one. I don't know. Um, but to me, it tastes pretty much like peanut butter and jelly. So I got this for me for my pool sandwiches. And then I also got some seedless strawberry jelly to go with that. This Kinder sauce was on sale and the chicken one is one that we've not tried. So I went ahead and bought that for Bryson and everybody else to try. Two macaroni and cheese meals to have in the freezer and then one of Bryson's rigatoni chicken and pesto. 
Man, I still have so much I haven't said. Um, sweet chili Doritos for Bryson. I wanted some white cheddar popcorn, so I got that mostly for me, but I'm sure everybody else will eat it too. And then I got a thing of salt and vinegar chips for sandwiches tonight. Um, zero sugar sweet tea, the gold peak for Chris. This granola I just got. I don't necessarily plan on eating granola bowls this week. However, ma'am, excuse you, you may not have the turkey. Um, however, I don't know when I'll be back at Food Lion and this is my favorite granola and I can't find it anywhere else. So I went ahead and got that while I was there. And then there are a couple things back here. My Italian ice, which I have not had in a week, so I'm missing that. Paper towels we needed. I got a bottle of Coke just to have with the sandwiches tonight. I was I like Coke and sandwiches, so I'm gonna have that with my sandwich. And then I got one thing of whole milk for the kids. And then if I need another one throughout the week, I will get another one. We don't like Sam's Club milk. Chris says it's bad and tastes like water. I don't know, but we don't like it. So I just got one there. Um, so yeah, that is everything that I got at Food Lion. So I guess that's part one of my grocery haul. Um, I mentioned earlier that you guys would see the hauls on Sunday and Monday, and I don't know what I was thinking because that ain't gonna happen. You will see them on Monday and Wednesday. So you'll see, you should be seeing this one on Monday and on Wednesday, you will get the second half of my post-vacation restock hauls of the Sam's Club haul. And then hopefully Friday, the Timu haul. So that's kind of the schedule for the week. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. I'm glad to be back. It was a good vacation, but I'm glad to be back and making content and doing what I love. Um, so yeah, hope you'll stick around for more content to come. I hope you have a great start to your week and I'll see you on Wednesday. Bye guys. No!